My name is Lex Burberry. I served with the United States Marine Corps from 1970 to 1972. It's during Vietnam. No veteran ever serves for glory or anything like that. It's just, you get kind of just a, an urge, you know, it's just, it's kind of hard to explain. It's like a drive. I served with some real good people. There was a lot of teamwork, a lot of camaraderie. I miss it still today. The world's so focused on me and we're not focused on everybody else. And we really, we really need to think about other people. Consideration and compassion, you know, go a long way. The, the military gave me that. It gave me organization and it gave me a direction. But always remember respect and be kind and compassionate. And it's stayed with me to this very day. There's a, a sense of, of pride for what you've done. But in a very humble way, I know when I go out and wear a veteran hat or a veteran's t-shirt, people say, you know, thank you for serving. And when I first came back from the UK, my brother said, you're gonna have to get used to that. And I said, nobody's gonna say that to me. But they did, and I was shocked. And then I almost felt embarrassed for wearing my shirt. You don't really know how to react when somebody says that because you didn't do it for that to begin with. You just did it because you wanted to. I'm really glad I served. I'd do it again in a heartbeat. If they, if they take me at 70, I'd go. But, you know, we, we just did it. We did it for the country and for the people and for freedom. I think the big thing that bothers me sometimes is people, you know, they say, well, I, I didn't serve. You know, it's, it's, it's no shame in not serving. You know, somebody's got to be here to fix the pipes and to fix the cars and to build. And, and, you know, that's what makes America great. Those people that, that went, we wanted to. And <clears throat> for those that stay behind, they needed to just continue to continue. Because what you're doing, it makes a difference. It may not feel like it, but it does. Every little bit helps. Every person makes their mark. You are important, so stick to it. Let's just all pray that they come home safe. Let God be with them. It's a hard task. And you'll be changed. But just come home.